I need to save right now. <sighs> Holy shit. You do some shopping. Thank you. Whew. Okay. Now, I'm gonna use some. Okay, let's go check that, see if we can go check that well that they were talking about. Okay, now. Dude, how much longer is your chapter? I know that. Sedata in the moon. <sighs> in minor cases of Luna Sedata, fragment, fragment, fragmentary memory loss and behavior similar to sleepwalking can be observed. Characteristically, the symptoms vary from the waxing and waning of the moon. When the moon is full, the patient's condition is stable, but there is a tendency to go outside and seek the moonlight. Around the new moon, the patient becomes more unstable and increasingly frightened. Once Luna Sedata, once Luna Sedata was Luna Sedata was called moonwalking, or haunted walking, which seems to be derived from that behavior. In several cases, the patient loses almost all memory, but remains attached to the moonlight and seeks out window sills and rooftops. Then the patient bathes in the moonlight. More lucid patients describe the feeling as momentarily regaining something they've lost. A person who has lost their memory will always look up at the moon. Such an odd symptom can surely happen in a psychological disturbed individual, but there's no explanation why a group of people would display the same symptoms. So this is a particular so this is particular a particular blah, 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 I forget to islands cultural sphere there must be a relationship to its beliefs and customs okay so we'll learn more about this disease oh my god this place is freaky This place is so scary. Where are you? What the fuck?
Assistance Note 3. Daily treatment of Luna Sedata syndrome continues. While we are more while we are making progress with Dr. Hayabara's treatment, the methods are so different from the accepted medical standard that I feel quite confused. Dr. Hayabara tends to his own technique tends to his own unique methods, as well as honoring the island's customs and using traditional treatment and me, treatment methods. This is especially true for treatments with their own special utensils, some of which would be unthinkable at, in other hospitals. What leaves me in even greater discomfort is the language used in this hospital, which bears no resemblance to proper medical terminology. Patients in a progressed state show fear of mirrors, water, and other items that are unable that are able to reflect their faces. Judging from their behavior, there must be moments when the patient feels that it's not his or her face that is reflected in the mirror. On the island, this is called budding. And this wor word is used in the hospital as a regular term. Furthermore, a state called blooming is feared the most. I don't know what kind of state this is, but everybody reacts strongly and pales at the word blooming. Apparently, the story goes that only the person who is budding can see their own face in this budding state. Of course, this sense of the word is, is, not, to, is not just to have budded. Upon seeing the face of another severe patient, the symptom seems to be referred to seems to be referred, which is called resonance. But surely this can't be so extreme. It's difficult to imagine, but there might be some con be a contagious form of Luna Sedata syndrome. And now, starting from tomorrow, Dr. Hayabara is letting me do the preparations. I wonder what the so-called ceremony of passage treatment method is like. What am I supposed to do? All of this leaves me quite concerned. Okay, so what is the budding and the blooming? Is that's what ha is that's what happening to their faces when they go purple and stuff? Do they bloom? LS treatment. Traditional therapy failed. Alternate methods attempted. Special treatments. Music therapy. Neurosurgery, etc. Are blooming slash budding stages of the syndrome? Ceremony of passage. Huh. Alrighty. We are all learning stuff. What is that? Blinking. The lamp on in the director's office is turned on. Is someone here? Oh! Where'd you go?
Wasn't it nice how it was like, was someone here? Then BAM! Yes, there was. He's right behind your ass. Alright. Don't fake me out. 